inhaling here, exhaling now, here, now, here, now. If you feel a noise inside, you can exhale with from your mouth and we sound like here, now, ah, like that. Whatever will take care of the inner noise that you might be experiencing. Here, now, I invite you to move your presence inwards, moving our presence inwards. Listening to our inner experience. as we invite the breath to become longer and slower and invite ourselves to relax through this rhythm of longer and slower and more longer and more slower As we're listening to our breath and listening to our inner experience, listening within is just focusing your awareness on your inner experience and measuring it, taking a yardstick. Does it feel very scattered in the thoughts? Do you feel energies inside? What is going on with me right now? How am I doing slash feeling? Let me stop a second just to thinking and be with me, with my experience, not with me, Ronit, with me, each one of yourselves, and my experience right now. Let me take my life a couple of notches slower to just drink this moment as it is experienced within me. Energetic noise feels like a lot of scattered points of movement inside you or in your experience. Kind of like seltzer, but with points, not round. So take your deep breath in and you listen inside and you feel the bubbles and you just go, it helps. Let's do a few of those for those of you who feel extra. And those of you who are not just presence. We're one group. Everyone is affecting everything in this group and in the world. But let's just stay with this group for now.
So I promised from last time that we speak and experience a deeper state of the energy of inspiration. But first, because of this moment, I want to reiterate about presence. Because as people join together, and I'm so grateful to see you here, and it's an energetic group, it's beautiful. But people come or live their lives in a state of scattered presence. And it's like you're taking the river of your powerful expression and you dilute it with so many things and things about things. And I know that's the way of the world and the mass consciousness is kind of living in a somewhat of a state of a mental this is and that's that jump all the time. I highly recommend to stop several times a day and to check your presence pulse. Just pause, like freeze frame and see at this second, how am I doing? My thoughts are racing. Am I thirsty? Am I breathing? Am I sitting in my chair and my hips are numb and I'm not even feeling it? Am I spinning with a thought? Am I happy? If you open and present in a state of expansion, those moments are stopped and spent in gratitude. Those moments are happening where every once in a while you go, I am so grateful for this moment. But when you're in a mental, spinny, diluted presence state and you stop, it helps you to get to the gratitude moment. It's almost like an extra step. Where am I right now? Let me start breathing, feel where I am, remember that I'm alive and that it's not a given that I'm alive, it's a miracle. Let me thaw this moment into presence. That. And just taking a moment or so to just step into the depth of this moment. Not the racing of what was and the trying to race towards the next thing. Breath. When you take a deep breath, feel like you're going to the depth of your soul. The depth of your being. within, in your experience. See if you can get to a spot where you need nothing. Just melt into this moment. Just be here as is need nothing
the breath. Going in and out, feel how the breath is caressing the heart. And there's the space of nothing but here and now. As your breath is caressing your heart, that deep breath that goes down towards your navel and into some kind of a deep depth in you that's beyond your physical body. Can you feel that? Just breathe in. Send it low and deep and there is your navel and then it kind of disappears somewhere into some kind of a depth that is not in your body. That's an energetic depth. But your navel is almost like the gate to going there. And on the way, going in and going out, the breath is caressing the heart like around it. And when that happens, the depth and the caress of the heart, you may attain a state of well-being in the moment. Not because you got a light. Not because of anything, just well-being of existence. And in that depth place, no words, it almost feels like heavy. So inspiration here, I'm connecting it to the topic of inspiration, is not through flying. It's through being in a space where everything is born from. It's the stillness of the moment of just about. Just about. Just about what? Just about. Right before spring, we know what happens. Right before a baby's born, right before the dawn breaks, right before the Big Bang, right before. Can you feel this moment of right before? In the timelessness of creation, there is a moment that's right before, and that's all it is. Can you feel that? Feels like a spring, and the more you are 
connecting with it, a spring that you wound, wind, not the spring, the season, but also the season. Feel the charge, the depth, caressing your heart. And either stay here or let it go to the next moment. Just see what happens. It'll either happen on its own, or you're just in the moment of depth and heart. And right before. So much light, so much light, melting, melting into light. Connecting with the light. You are light. What does that mean that you are light? The energy that is your life force has a light quality to it, just like a light bulb, just like the sun. It warms. It lights up, it ignites and igniting. And if you can see energies, it appears in colors, like light is. The spectrum of light, the rainbow. Inspiration. Cold and light. Breath, light, the moment before burst into light through the space of this meditation. You might personally were bursting into a different moment, it's fine. Light in the cells, light in the breath, connecting to the light presence that you are. Feel how with every breath the light shines even brighter, expands wider.
Take those deep breaths and see how breathing in the light of creation is expanding, light of creation as it goes through your body. Just pump it in. Yes. Exhaling your state of being out into the world. Breathing in the light of creation. Feeling it expanding the cells. Yes, exhaling your presence into the world. Being in this space, completely present to this space. Remember that about you. Remember that you're that. This space of ever expanding light. Stillness. One with the moment, here and now, inhaling here, exhaling now. I was going to be inspiration, continuing from last time, but the moment showed me that this group is inviting the being in the moment experience. So that's where we are. There is an inspiration to being in the moment. But being in the moment is about being in the moment. So breathing, going deep into the breath. Letting it caress your heart. Gratitude of this moment.
feeling the spring of inspiration coming, breathing in the light and starting to feel a buildup of something ready to launch. And then let it burst when it bursts or not. The moment of just about is the key to inspiration. Just about. And some people think they're just about mental. Oh, I hope there'll be cake, and I hope we'll do this, and I hope this will happen, and that will happen, and they have a big, huge grocery, grocery list for their just about. Instead of just being present and allowing it to happen, boom. Even, even nothing happening is something that happens, boom. Allowing. From presence. From understanding the mechanism of birthing. Presence and light and gratitude and allowance. That's it. Not lists and expectations including the expectation for disappointment. Allowing. And taking a deep breath. Exhaling with sound if you have it. And as soon as you're ready, you're welcome to open your eyes.